A store owner in Cobb County was hit by thieves three times in one day. And what's even more strange, it appears one guy kept coming back for more. Fox 5's Denise Dillon got a close-up look at the surveillance video. It's the details in the video, details that are hard to miss, that make these thefts so bizarre. And what he's getting now is a gas lawnmower. A couple of guys who appear to be just browsing, picking through boxes and equipment. And they're taking lawn care equipment, pressure washers. They're going through and seeing what they can get. This is inventory that belongs to a shop called Almighty Products on Canton Road in Marietta. We buy pallets and we sell them at a discounted rate. We sell lawn equipment, pressure washers, power tools, any of your DIY equipment. Typically, the shop takes extra inventory to a storage facility at the end of the day. But this past Saturday, they didn't do that. That's the same day these two guys pulled up and started loading up their truck. I feel like they maybe possibly could have been watching us, knowing that we weren't coming back. No masks, no disguises, but a very unique T-shirt on this guy. This shirt says, I love my wife. I think it's just ironic, you know, that he's stealing and it's just a bad, a bad look. Two hours later, a different vehicle pulls up, but there's something familiar about this man. He is back to steal more, to get more. How do you know it's the same guy? His shirt. His shirt is um, the I love my wife shirt. Two hours later, darkness has fallen and look who's back. The guy in that now all too familiar, I love my wife shirt. It's a little scary in the fact that they feel comfortable to take what they want just in broad daylight and then come back for more. Katrina Whiting says more than $11,000 worth of items were stolen during the three thefts. That's a big hit for a small business and she wants these guys caught. I don't want them to be coming back to steal anymore. The owner has now taken additional security measures. In Cobb County, Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News. All right, Denise, thanks very much. Jeff Hill is